Hey guys, um, very quick impromptu, sorry for the no makeup to glory and for my little screamy little Ishmael up here. Um, I was made aware by a few people on Facebook, by Tilly, and other people such as that. Now, all of my opinions on this are my own. If you disagree, leave me a comment down below, but you had better make a good argument. Let's just put it that way. Just don't say, your opinion's stupid because you're ugly. Okay. <laughs> but this is about PAX banning babe boo babe girls or whatever the case may be at booths, okay? Now I've read the article two times. It's something that I'm like uh, again on the fence about, just like most controversies. But the thing is though, it kind of makes me a little bit irked, okay? Their main excuse for banning the boot the ba booth babes. There we go. Haha. -ha booth babes is that they're taking more attention away from the actual booths or vendors there. I don't think so because if there's a signing or something like that, people want to see their anime favorite cosplayer, girl, guy, whatever the case may be, in, you know, sexy cosplayer or something like that. But here's the thing though, sexy is not, sexy is in the eye of the beholder. Someone may look at me and go, that's sexy right there. Or someone may go, oh, that's gross, I don't want to see that. So it, I am on the fence about it. But it's more making me more irked at the fact that it's only targeting women. Just because there are male cosplays where some guys would wear a male jock strap, basically, or a male thong. Just like Last Anime Expo. I basically saw saw someone cosplaying from Nude Beach, but he had on a thong and with his junk hanging out and nothing else with purple glowy nipples. Sorry if you want to hear my separate rant about that. I'm not big on Kill Kill. But the thing is, though... That's not appropriate in my eyes. Just like if I was had the same reaction if I saw a girl just in a brawn panty with the little Batman mask. I'm Batman! Well, you're wearing a thong and that armor's not going to protect Jack. That's my take on it. But you also have to look at the fact that, like I said, people might not be... It's in the eye of the beholder. I could look, you know, you could look at that and just say, oh, that's way too sexy. Mm -mm. Cover that up. Well, it's just a shirt. You know, sex cosplays on um, another topic. A lot of characters from video games, animes, they have revealing clothing. You can't help that. That is the character. Are you going to ban all the characters that have revealing, I don't know, boobs? Because for the simple fact, oh, the booth babes are, you know, oh, too sexy kind of thing. No, you're not. That's, you know, you're cutting out a big portion of costuming, which a lot of people work really hard to do. But I do understand where young children go to these events and they do see, you know, male jockstrap, they do see male girl boobies all out, or they may see, you know, way too short a skirt, blah, blah, this and that. That's where I pretty much come from the argument of, well, that might not be appropriate. But the parents who bring their children to Anime Expo, if they have brought them before, they know what their children's going to see. Someone who hasn't gone, do your research. Parents, if, you're, if you want to go to Comic-Con, Anime Expo, PAX, whatever the case may be. Research it first. Look it up on Facebook. Check out the vibe. That's what I did for my first Anime Expo. I was excited. And I looked it up and I'm like, okay, I can expect that. But people who just go in blind eye, then, oh, complain. Oh my God, there's two revealing cosplayers here. Oh my goodness. Well, you should have done your research. But as far as uh, being on the fence about the booth babes, no. It's, for me, it's only targeting women. It said nothing in the article about men. So if I see a man dressed seen in that man thong I was talking about earlier, are you going to 86 a sexy male cosplays? It's just a question that really has been going on in my mind. I do apologize, guys, if I seem scatterbrained. I do this kind of stuff not... What's the word? Not preparing ahead of time. I just speak what my mind throws out and stuff like that. So if I'm a little condescending, confusing, I'm sorry. It's just me. I do want to know what you guys think about the booth babes. If Anime Expo does this or any other place for that matter, I don't know how many people will actually go there. Let's just put it that way. Because costuming is a big thing for Anime Expo or for anyone who attends in general. Some people don't like to cosplay. I'm a cosplayer who likes to cosplay, but am I going to stop be stopped at the gate because I'm showing a little bit of cleavy cleave and they say, oh, hey, that's way too appropriate. Um, I just saw a guy in a man thong take two steps in here. What? So I really wish that the article would specify a little bit better. Not so much. Just it seems to me like it's targeting women in sexy cosplays. 
you're getting more attention, in my opinion, when you have babe booths there than anything. Because the guys want to see the babe booths and they're going to check out the booth when they're looking at the babes. And they're going to look at everything. You can have a sexy girl. Hi, what do you want to buy? That kind of stuff. I've seen a lot of that and it's very successful. But for people at PAX to say, oh, hey, whoa, wait a minute. You know, um, you're drawing attention away from our booths. I don't technically think that. Because if I see a hot and smexy guy besides my boyfriend over, you know, over in the corner wearing nothing but a man thong, I probably will go check out that booth. Don't get me wrong. But it, to me, seems like a double standard, like a flip side coin. So I really want to know what you guys think about this. It's just my rambling. I'm very sorry. I personally hope that they don't do it because now you're regulating what girls can wear, what guys can wear. Now you're dictating what's sexy and what's not and, you know, and stuff like that. Now, of course, if I see someone with pasties and a thong, then I'm going to stop them there. Because that's a, too appropriate and there are small children. But, you know, at least cover it up. I mean, come on now. Let's be honest. We're all adults. And some people may not be adults, so that's what also concerns me. So I want to know what you guys think. Please hit me up down below. If you think my opinion's stupid, you had better give me something. Hi, Mom. To the fact of that. But please make a good argument. I want to know what you guys think about the banning of booth babes. Let me know. I love you guys so much. And thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time. Bye-bye.